Oh, it's so fast, bro. Let's go. Let's run that shit. Bro, race the 335 with your weak ass car. Let's run it. Run the Evo. What's up guys, it's your boy Anthony, AKA Legacy Works. Today we are on our way to a meet in Claremont. It's gonna be at Claremont Toyota at the dealership. Uh, I'm riding with my Evo, obviously, and I have a good buddy of mine who is driving my other car, uh, the RSX. And we're gonna be heading out right now. We're just gonna watch the cars. And we're gonna be ready to go. The homie Marquez. I'm driving that car. I'm driving this one. So yeah. Alright guys, we are heading out to Claremont Toyota and both cars are already washed and we'll see you guys there. What's up guys? So we made it to the meet at Claremont Toyota. So the cars are all nice and washed. Jeez, look at that. Man, the cars look fucking fresh. Look at that. My two babies parked next to each other. And Marquez drove it. And this is the turnoff for right now. We're gonna see what's up and we're gonna go have some fun. Pretty clean, pretty clean. You already know what this is, baby. You already know what this is. I'm gonna have one of these one day. cars that we haven't seen and also cars that are actually from the Fast and the Furious movie. They have about one, two, three. Woo. They have about four Fast and Furious cars. Um, they haven't, I don't know, well, unless I'm not sure. They haven't announced who is the, the special Fast and Furious guest, but we're gonna see so far. Um, I haven't seen anything, but we'll see if they announce it soon. Uh, it's more likely going to be Jesse or Hector slash Noel. So we'll see right I think it's actual rust. I think this is rust. It, no, yeah, look at the, look that's tight. Look, look, look. That's a chip right there. I don't know, man. It looks kind of. It looks kind of like. I don't know. It looks like a. It looks like it's a wrap, but it looks like it's. Or maybe it could be actual paint. Yeah. 
two uh, multiple layers. Including myself, I'm not gonna lie. Man, that was like the highlight of. Say what's up, big sexy. What are you doing? <laughs> yeah. guys we are on our way back home um the meet was pretty cool uh we got to run into miguel which is pretty cool and then that 350z that was on slicks right now man that thing is crazy pushing p hey pushing p for <laughs> show man pushing p for show but yeah dude it was a pretty dope meet and we're gonna drive back home and we'll see y'all later
guys, I'm gonna try to keep it as short as possible. So, what caused that incident to happen? So, me and the homies, uh, we went to Kane's. Um, I was driving my Evo and he was driving my RSX. Um, so, we went to Kane's and there's these dudes. There's a G35 in the front and then there's some Kia in the back. Whatever, you know. So, the G35 started revving at us when we were about to leave. You know, and uh, at first it was just just car stuff, you know, just car BS, you know. Uh, he was revving. I told him, hey, like, get out the line. Let's run that shit for some money. He said that he got money, blah, blah. Okay, cool. I was like, come on, then let's go. Let's go run it, blah, blah. So at first it was just about cars, okay. And then after that, they weren't down. So we're about to leave. And the dude in the G35, the passenger, he's saying some stuff to my homie's girl saying like oh like what's up bitch like well, i don't know if I'm, I'm gonna crop that out but what's up b like you know like i'll f you up blah blah so that's when we got pissed off we're like dude like how are you gonna try to press a female but when we we're talking to you pressing you you didn't do nothing so that's how that whole situation escalated and uh, they said they kept saying that they had guns they had guns but me when i'm at a point where i get pissed off dude i don't care i don't care what they have i told them i'm like go ahead i might pull out whatever you want put out a knife a gun i don't care the moment you pull it out is the moment you're getting knocked the head, you know the fuck out you know i, I told them i like, go ahead i might pull whatever you want out for you guys to feel like you guys have power and i'll knock that shit out i'll knock you out right away but they didn't do nothing you know and there was four against two and then there was two people in the back that was backing them up too. I told them like they can get it too. And I, and then they were like, oh, like we'll pull up on you right now. I'm like, go ahead. And then that's when the video cut off and we waited the whole time for them to get out of line to get, for them to get their food, whatever. And they just dipped out, you know? So, so we ended up leaving, you know? And uh, that's, ba that's pretty much it, man. It just, um, it was something stupid that escalated from, from cars for them from cars to threatening a woman you know like it was just stupid you know so that's why we got pissed off but they didn't want it at the end of the day i mean whatever dude you know like like how are you gonna try to press somebody saying you got guns and then i said i don't give a fuck and the, you and you still don't want to fight like that makes you a straight up pussy you know but anyways that's what happened um that's to keep the long story short um so yeah man so <laughs> that's the end of the video um hope you guys liked it hope you guys like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in another one peace